earlier. I think they mess up your sentence to come here and this is like the first tier of uh, court systems you come to to get your case uh, re-examined. Do you know that moment oh, yeah. where you're about to jaywalk and make eye contact with a policeman standing on the other side of the road? This is something that happens. It's a great moment. This is something that happens frequently in your life too. It happened just before and that's the first time it's happened ever. Good morning, it is another lovely day in the hut, hopefully in Wellington as well. About to head into town now, got to get my hair cut and then have a meeting for a new project. breakfast today so I think we all know where I'm gonna end up. Good sticker right there. I already have a few of the street, Bond Street. I'm pretty sure I already have this one as well, Bond Street. I have this one as well. So Free coffee though, not bad. I've still got another 15 minutes but I'm slowly making my way towards this meeting. I'm just gonna meet Jimmy for a quick chat. What's up Jimmy? Long, How are you today? I'm good. Just had good. to gas it down here to make it on time. Just to make it on time for this like two minute discussion. This two minute thing, I prioritise um, Siren's vlog over my daily needs. How about you Siren? Oh, what do you got? I'm going for a bit of a meeting for the radio thing. We want you to host the night show, right? Oh yeah, man. You should host like, like 10 till 6 a.m. Midnight ambience hour. Yeah. That's the one. With Jimmy B. Midnight ambience hour with Jimmy B. Here's the uh, powerhouse of New Zealand government right here. We've got the beehive. Who knows, will they change the flag? Won't they? We've got this uh, arrangement of poles here to prevent any uh, truck bombs from ramming the premises. Here's one news setting up for their live cross. There's like newception. We're like making news on people making news. What are you doing? Nice to see you today. I know, so am I. Jimmy V came down especially to make the vlog. I did. He came down for the vlog. Yeah, I was in completely the other end of town. Just sprinted down because I knew the buses weren't going to be as fast as Jimmy V. Welcome to the vlog, Jimmy. It's good to be here. It's a privilege and an honour. I'll put it in my CV. You'll put it on your CV? Yeah, well, I've been in Siren's vlog. That, okay. That's like the pinnacle of um, my achievements in the media, is making it on Siren's vlog. It's like the Letterman show, it's like, it's above. Just it's a bit of spill. official Siren and Glee media ventures. And where are you going? I'm just uh, seeing where the road takes me. See, <laughs> Is the road going to happen to take you to the same place as our meeting? Yeah, it just happened to, like, quite ironically. Took me where you exactly where you're going. Uh, come. Top secret meeting, mate. Yeah, but that just makes me want to come more. You saying that? You should have said, "Oh no, it's just nothing." I'm just. It's a nothing meeting. <laughs> Glenn and I are just having it's coffee. Top secret. I could be like Edward Snowden, like spilling all the uh, the knowledge there is to be spilled. See you later, Jimmy. See you later. Have a good one, mate. It's lovely meeting today. Welcome to the vlog team. Yes, he records everything. I record everything now. <laughs> Two hours later, this meeting's still going. Most people have left. Glenn and Tim are still here. Sitting at one table for two hours is a bit extreme. You need to change your scenery after two hours. How are we today? <laughs> Pretty good, eh? No, <laughs> just let it go. Drama school fan. <laughs> Three and a half hours later, we leave the National Library. Goodbye, Tim. Goodbye. Should I get McDonald's or sushi? 
I reckon we got Subway. Subway no, sandwich. No, we're going the wrong we're way for Subway. Subway's there. No, we go to another Subway. No, there's other Subway. Yeah, okay, no, no, Subway is not an option. Why well, Subway not an option? It's not that good. <laughs> McDonald's is nice. So she's like, Glenn, what are you getting Saren for his birthday? I'm like, man, no. <laughs> I'm yeah, like, what previously I've just got him chocolate or something. The bus so will stop for us to cross the road. 83 would probably just run you over. <laughs> We're going to Mecca's. Don't you feel like such a weirdo wandering around the campus? No. You need so to stop being self conscious, Tom. Mecca's men, Sarah. You're actually. We've <laughs> done some really weird shit. We've done much weirder things than this. Uh, we've um, asked police officers when the Prime Minister would be leaving our <laughs> building. Welcome to Mecca's. Let's go. Can I get a large segment of cheese from the back? We've moved today, we're at the um so we've moved today, we're at the Bunny Street Railway Station Makers. Really quality chips. We've mixed out five stickers five. today, five stickers. Gotta get the Georgie Pie combo, large combo, fourth with the large combo, one with the Georgie Pie. Oh, this is not a good start. <laughs> One of the most popular. Northumberland. Two Northumberlands at the same time. Trafalgar Square. Another popular one. This is bad. Four more. I'm not sure I have. I have five four more. My last one today. Strand. Also popular. Not even an instant win for Glen today. Okay. Yes! We have an instant win. Oh. Sausage McMuffin. Second instant win of the day. I got a small Mac Cafe coffee this morning. <laughs> Instant win, Big Mac. Oh. <laughs> I'm on a roll today. Yeah. Northumberland. No, I've got three of those. I have this station, one of the train stations. Vine Street. Also a popular one. Two instant wins in one meal. We're at the large upgrade. What are the instant wins for you today? Small fries and $25 hotel oh, e voucher. Good. Thank you for this, joining us for this <laughs> Monopoly sticker presentation. Goodbye, Glenn. Goodbye. Goodbye. I will see you later, Thomas. We'll see you tomorrow. I haven't really shown off my tea collection. I guess I showed that order a few days ago. But this is where I need to get. Look at this. This is a tea cupboard. This is the ultimate goal, you know. We need to acquire a large collection of teas. This is Lee's collection. Welcome to this vlog special presentation. How to make lemon honey and ginger. It's sticky, so fair warning. No, I don't have a treat for you, yeah, there we go. What's up, Toby? No, I'm not giving you attention today. Basically what you do is you put everything into the jug right there. Chuck that in there. Put the skin, remove the skin. Boiling water. Boiling water in a plastic jug, is that advisable? Yeah. Excuse me. Oh, it's, it's too, stop filming, it's too big. Found a normal size sieve for making drinks. You can see, see that in there. See. Pouring um, boiling water into a glass, is that advisable? It's no longer boiling. It's, this is my first impressions video. This look is the technology YouTubers like to call it of the Lee Fletcher lemon, honey and ginger. Oh, this is actually quite good. Yeah. It is. This is an empty train. What's wrong with the ending of yesterday's vlog? You made me sound really mean. I'm not that mean to you. I'm nice to you. <laughs> I'm commenting now. Thanks for that comment. Go away. <laughs> Letter and talk time. Not much mail today, but there's one piece of mail. It comes from Victoria University of Wellington. Let's open it. So I wanted to, I know Asmara, I can see you have just like turned your chair away from your desk and you're just sitting there watching me. 
So why did I start this vlog? I guess there's a lot going on at the moment. I'm about to start my last three weeks at school, ever. And I kind of want to remember that, that specifically. And then also, holidays coming up. I'll be spending time with friends who will be going to university elsewhere. I won't see them as much anymore. And I just kind of want to memorize that in a way. And this is kind of like a really entertaining format to do that in. I guess that's it. This is starting to come to like a very anticlimactic ending. I'll throw something at the camera for you. What else? <laughs> what the hell is that? I'm sorry, you wanted a good ending.